Hi, I'm Mrs. Thompson, your child's first grade classroom teacher, and I want to discuss the results of your child's recent testing. The results will help us identify your child's strengths and also identify areas that may need to be improved. Your child's test scores are compared to other groups of students who have taken the same test. The group of students in the comparisons may be local children or they may be children from all around the country. They might be in the same grade level or they might be in a different grade. The first results we are going to look at are the grade level equivalent scores. This test is written specifically for a certain grade, like the fourth grade test your child took. But other grades also take this same test. Your child's test results are compared against the average performance of students in other grade levels. For example, your child's grade equivalent score in reading is 5.4. This means your child did as well in reading as the average fifth grader in the fourth month of the school year. However, since this score should not be interpreted as your child needing to move up a grade, it means your child can read as well as the average fifth grader who took the same fourth grade test that your child took. I know this can be confusing. Do you have any questions? Now let us look at the results in the percentile ranks column. Darcy's scores are good. She is doing fourth grade work and she is keeping up with her peers. Her reading score is 59. This tells us that on a scale of 1 to 99, Darcy did better than 59 of the children taking this test. The average score for this test was 50, so you can see that Darcy is doing well. Darcy's math score was 64, so again, she did better than 64 of the children taking this test. Some areas we need to work on are language expression and improving our vocabulary when listening. I know this, again, can be confusing. Do you have any questions? Lastly, Stay 9 scores are graded on a scale of 1 to 9. Stay 9 is short for standard 9. Stay 9 scores are described as 1 to 3 being low, 4 to 6 average, and 7 to 9 high. Darcy would be in the average to above average categories. I believe Darcy is doing well and that she will continue to be successful. Do you have any questions? This was a lot we covered. I will call in a few days so I can give you some time to organize your thoughts and form your questions. Thank you.